type of person who really stands up for what I believe in. How wild I am not. When TLC first started, we were happy. Um, shortly after that, we had managerial problems. Then I had my legal problems, and things didn't seem to be quite so fun anymore. And um, there were times when we fought like sisters. At the end of the day, um, we're happy to be together. We're happy to be recording our fourth LP. I'm not a wild person, but if you're going to compare me to the other two group members, you know, I have probably had the wildest um, statements. I have done a, a wild thing when, when Andre and I got into the house situation and the house burnt down, you know, and I think people saw that as like outlandish, like, oh, she's, you know. <laughs> It's not frustrating at all for me to get the type of attention that I get when the house situation happened, when the media wrote certain things about me and I was labeled as being crazy. At the end of the day, I did notice that it actually did help sell records. Unfortunately, um, T-Boz and Chili did not take me up on the challenge. You know, I wanted to do a three CD set where each of us did a solo album and um, we included it in one package. And um, they didn't take me up on it. I didn't miss the girls when I did my solo project at all. I had been looking forward to doing a solo project since the birth of TLC. TLC. Leaving the things that were just meant to be. I would love to do another um, song with Mel C. This time, being on my project. If there's a song that I think that she's appropriate for, I will definitely send it to her. I see some comparisons between TLC and Destiny's Child. It seems like there's there are some influence influences from TLC as far as styling is concerned. And there's definitely room enough for the two of us and about ten more. <laughs>